morning, y'all. I'm on my way to take the car to get an oil change. Also, something's going on with the GPS in the car. So I'm getting all of that checked out. Today, I'm off work today. So, and I'm going to run a few errands and take you all along with me. It's foggy today outside. It's a little chill in the air, but they said, the weather said it's gonna be about 80 degrees today. I'm gonna stop and get me some coffee, get my morning started, and I don't know if I'm gonna get a sand. I'm going to Dunkin' Donuts. Oh, there's a lot of traffic out. It's a Monday morning, so good morning to everyone. dealership just waiting on my car I got to get an oil change tire rotation they said something about a fuel injection cleaning and they got to check the GPS because the GPS went out so I'm waiting they don't know if they're gonna have to keep my car and get, try to get me a loaner car so they checking <laughs> guys so looks like they might have to keep my car they've given me a loaner car um so gonna wait and see well i'm not gonna wait and see i'm gonna go ahead and run my errands and they said they'll call me if everything can get done today if not i have the loaner car um uh, until then and so I have nowhere to put my phone, so I'm going to have to like talk to y'all as I go and hold this phone. Alrighty, I'll see y'all in a little bit. Bye. Okay, I found the space for the phone. I don't know if it's going to fall though as I get to driving. Um, I never did get my coffee yet, so I still need to do that. Um, this thing is gonna fall. Oh no. Is it gonna fall? Is it gonna fall? Oh, it fell. Hey, you guys, I'm headed into Home Goods. Hey, you guys. Happy Sunday. I think today is June the 8th, 8th or 9th. Um, getting ready to run a few errands, um, going to my sister's house. Also a little bit later, it's a beautiful day today, sunny out. Um, so I just wanted to check in with you guys to open the vlog. I'm just chit chat while I'm driving to my errands. Um, first stop, I am going to get the car wash. Car is pretty dirty. And then from there, and believe it or not, I haven't even ate anything today. And it's about, I think it's about one something. <sighs> I did get up this morning. Well, it was about 11. Um, I did my exercises. I do have to show y'all the home gym that I created. Um, has like a walking pad, a stepper. Uh, what else does it have? It has like a little roller thing where you roll for your abs. You roll it on the floor. I have like an exercise mat. I have a stationary bike. And then I have... Um, various weights and things and um, I 
forgot the name of the thing that you, it's called a, I think it's called a dumbbell, but no, kettle, kettlebell. The thing where you do squats that helps build your legs and your muscles. Um, so I'm trying to figure out what I want to get to eat. I was thinking about maybe some big B coffee. Maybe like an iced coffee. But it's a little late for coffee. Okay, it's 105. Usually I don't drink coffee after 12, so. So I hope everybody's having a beautiful day today. Um, enjoying the weather. Hopefully you're having good weather wherever you're at. And I just want to encourage people to stay positive about life if you can. I know it's hard to stay positive because there's a lot going on in the world and a lot going on in everybody's personal life. Even when people are smiling, you know, sometimes inside they're crying. So I just want to encourage you um, to put your trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not to your own understanding and all your ways acknowledge Him and He shall direct your path. Because that's what I do daily. Um, everybody has to work, got to pay bills, got children to take care of, husbands, wives, jobs, you know, people going through job stress, people going through financial worries and concerns. Um, you have to put your trust in a higher power. And you have to do it daily. Every day you got to put all your cares, all your worries, all your fears, you have to put it in God's hands. And that's what I try to do daily. You know, I was having some moments today, but God always works things out and he makes things beautiful. So, I'll see y'all a little bit later. Bye. Okay, I guess I'm not going to the car wash. They have a power outage, so I need to find another car wash. This is my favorite one, though. Tommy's. Tommy's Express Car Wash. I'll just take the ten dollar wash. I have cash. Yeah. Thank you too. Get me a icy bowl from Player Bowls. So delicious. I'm so hungry. So I always get the pure Vita bowl. I think I got it before. Y'all seen it before. Strawberries, blueberries, and granola.
They say ICI is pretty healthy. But I think as long as you don't overdo it, but with the fruit and everything. Let me get a strawberry, blueberry, and a little vanilla on this bowl if I can. This bowl is tight. Ah. So I'm just going to sit in the car, eat my little granola, and uh, boil my bowl, I see my bowl, and then go run my errands. See y'all in a little bit. Okay, I'm done with my ICI bowl. Oh, that was so delicious. So, continue with my errands. Let me switch out my glasses because it's a bit sunny today. Oh, you can go ahead. Oh. On to my next stop. I think I need to stop by TJ Maxx because. There's this body um, body wash I like. It's like a lavender. They don't really sell it anywhere. That I can see. I think it's called Dr. Dr. Jason's. It's like an all natural body wash. And it smells like. Well this particular scent is lavender. So. And it doesn't irritate my skin. My skin is sensitive. So I can't use everything on my skin. But this particular body wash. It's really great, and I can't find it anywhere else, so I'm going to go back to, even at another TJ Maxx I went to, I went to a different TJ Maxx and they didn't have it, so I'm going to go back to the same TJ Maxx where I originally found it, and, um, wait, which way is it though? Okay, wait, let me go this way. I'm going the wrong way. Where am I? Oh, God, which way am I going? Okay, I think it's the right way. Alright, so I'll see y'all when I get to TJ Maxx. I'm just going in there really quick just to get that and out because I don't have anything else in TJ Maxx I need to buy. So I'm going to look for that specifically. I had to get myself a pep talk. So when I go in there, you know how you talk to your children. When we go in there, don't be touching nothing. I'm not buying this and I'm not buying that. Don't touch nothing. So I'm trying to tell myself that. You just go in there looking for this body wash, and that's it. I'm not planning on spending a whole lot of money on nothing else. All right. <laughs> okay, so far I don't see the brand I'm looking for. Oh, Dr. Jacobs. Okay. This is a different scent, but it is it's Dr. Jacobs. Okay, so I'm going to try this one. I don't see the lavender one. Let me see if I can find another Dr. Jacobs. Uh, is this it? Yep, I think so. This is rose. I don't like that. Can I even smell the rose scent? I smelled the rose scent, Dr. Jacobs, but I don't like it. I don't really like the rose scent of rose, so I'll put that back. I wish I could find the lavender one I had before. I love that one. Okay, I'm gonna use my Yuka app on this so I can try it out and see how that is. I mean, I'll let y'all know what it Yuka app says. Okay, so the Yuka app gave this like a zero. I said it was bad, but it gave this an 86. I said it was excellent. So I'm gonna try this one out. 
and hope it doesn't irritate my skin. I'm tempted to get another coffee, tea mug. Um, can't have enough of those. I'm trying to see if there's any of them that I like a lot. Thank you. You too. I must be stopped. I didn't buy my one item. I bought like several items. But, you know, I think they were everything, you know, I needed. It wasn't just me just picking up miscellaneous stuff, but it's everything I can use.